Now, we have this data probability of event A is 0 0.5, probability of event B is 0 0.6 and probability of event A intersection B that means, A and B is 0 0.2. Then we have to find the probabilities of uh, uh, these different events. Now, we can put this data on Venn diagram. Uh, Venn diagram say equation bahut asani se ho jayega. We have easier solution using Venn diagram. Okay. Here we have sample space S. Okay. Events A and B are subsets of S. Okay. So, here we have event A and uh, event B. This is event A, this is event B. Now, probability of event A intersection B is 0.2. Okay. So, we put 0.2 value here in the region of A intersection B. Now, probability of event A is 0.5. Okay. So, here we put value 0.3. So, we have 0.3 plus 0.2 is equal to 0.5 which is probability of event A. This is how we fill the Venn diagram, different regions of Venn diagram. Now, probability of event B is 0.6, then what will be value here in this region? We have 0.2 already here. So, we put here value 0.4. Okay. Okay, now, some 0.3 plus 0.2 plus 0.4 is 0.9. Okay. So, we put 0.1 here in the outer region of A union B. Okay. Now, using this Venn diagram, we can answer these questions very easily. Like uh, here we have probability of A union B. A union B is uh, a region of sets A and B. In this we have values 0 0.3, 0 0.2, 0 0.4. Some of these values is 0 0.9. So, probability of A union B is 0 0.9. Okay. We can use formula also like probability of uh, A union B. This is equal to probability of uh, a plus probability of B minus probability of A intersection B. Put the values 0 0.5 plus 0 0.6 minus 0 0.2, 0 0.5 plus 0 0.6, 1.1, 1.1 minus 0 0.2 is 0.9. So, ye formula se bhi hum ye probability value la sakte hai, hai na? Now, we have to get the probability of event only A. Only A means uh, this region, region of set A excluding uh, A intersection B and this value is 0.3. Okay. In the form of set theory, we can write this way, probability of uh, event only A. Now, only A means A minus B. Okay. This is equal to probability of event A intersection uh, B complement. This is equal to probability of A minus probability of A intersection B using concepts of set theory and this is equal to 0 0.5 minus 0 0.2, this is equal to 0 0.3. Okay. Similarly, we can find probability of only B, this is equal to 0 0.4 from Venn diagram, this is equal to probability of uh, event B minus probability of event A intersection B. So, we have 0 0.6 minus 0 0.2 is equal to 0 0.4. Okay. Now, probability of this event exactly one of A and B occurs, exactly one of A and B occurs means either only A occurs or only B occurs. Simultaneously, both A and B are not occurring. A and B ek saath nahi ho rahe, yaan to sirf A ho rahe, yaan to sirf B ho rahe, theek hai? This is equal to, from Venn diagram, this is uh, 0 0.3 plus 0 0.4, this is equal to 0 0.7, okay? And using concepts of uh, set theory, this is equal to probability of uh, A plus probability of B minus 2 times probability of A intersection B. Why we are subtracting 2 times uh, probability of A intersection B? Because uh, A intersection B is a part of set A as well as part of set B. So, we have to exclude this probability 2 times. I mean, uh, A and B key dono ki probability mein se ye probability ko minus karna padega. That is why we are subtracting here two times. Okay. This is equal to 0 0.5 plus 0 0.6 minus two times 0 0.2. Okay. 
So, this is equal to 1.1 minus 0.4 equal to 0.7 okay, using uh, set theory. Now, this one probability of neither A nor B occurs, neither A nor B occurs means probability of event uh, A union B complement. Okay, this is equal to straight away 0 0.1, here value is 0 0.1. A union B complement means uh, region of uh, uh, sample space S, which is uh, outside A union B. Take care. So, A union B ka jo bahar ka jo region hai, us region mein value kya hai yaha pe 0 0.1. So, this is equal to 0 0.1. Okay. Using concepts of set theory, this is equal to probability of S minus probability of A union B. Probability of sample space S is 1. Probability of A union B is 0 0.9. So, this is equal to 0 0.1. Theek hai na? So, neither A nor B is event ka jo probability hai wo kya hoga? 0.1 ho jayega. So, hum dono tarah se kare, we are using uh, Venn diagrams as well as uh, uh, formulas. Addition theorem of probability. Now, let us find some more probabilities of these two events. This is event uh, complement of uh, a complement intersection B complement and this is event complement of uh, A complement union B complement. Now, here we can use uh, De Morgan's law of set theory using which we have here A complement intersection B complement is equal to A union B complement. Okay, so, we have here complement of uh, A union B complement plus and here a complement union B complement is equal to A intersection uh, B complement. Okay. So, here we have uh, complement of A intersection B complement. Okay. So, now we have to get this sum. Here complement of complement is uh, initial set. So, here we have probability of uh, A union B plus probability of uh, A intersection B. Okay. So, this is equal to probability of uh, A plus probability of B. Hai na? So, we have here 0.5 plus 0.6, this is equal to 1.1. .1. No surprise here if we get value more than 1, because here we are not finding probability of some event. Here we are finding sum of probabilities of two events, which can be more than one. Ye sum more than one ho sakta hai, kyunki yaha pe hum do probabilities ka sum nikaal da hai. Thik hai na?